I have to go away for a while. Um, the hardest sequence to film was the ballet scene. It was, it, it, it was, I trained for four months for three hours a day. Um, and I'm not a very graceful person. So it was very difficult, but it really helped me kind of get into the, to the mindset of these. It really helped build the character really because of the physical and mental discipline that goes into being a dancer. And also I started noticing halfway through, I started holding my body differently. I was, I was my muscles were changing. So the more my physicality started to change, the more I started to kind of understand who Dominica was going to be. What I like about this movie is I'm not playing a female James Bond. I'm not playing a female Jason Bourne. Every way that she gets ahead and every way that she's a hero, even though I kind of find her an anti-hero, she's using tools as a woman. Intu intuition, nurturing, sensuality. And that is what was interesting to me. And that's why this movie is, was, is unique. I mean, I believe in kind of a combination. I was just gonna say a combination. I think, I think honestly, when something, to me, when something good happens in your life, it's the combination of luck and preparation. It's like when those things happen, when you're prepared and you get the lucky moments to where those sort of two paths meet, that's when the great things happen. I mean, if I look at my career and I think about any of the sort of turning points in my career, I think it's always because I was prepared and then I got sort of a lucky encounter or a lucky opportunity, and I was just ready for it. So I think I think it's a combo. I mean, Francis has been a dear friend of mine for so many years, and I and I was a fan of his work before we even worked together on the Hunger Games, and then watching what he what he did with them, and and um, and reading the script, I I was so excited to see what he was going to do with this opening up a new world, a new character, starting something new from the ground up, and he has a very he has an amazing eye, and he has a unique perspective on everything that he works on. So. When I read the script, I, I couldn't wait to see what he did with it. No, I mean, I, I had a I, I had a really good time um, filming filming Red Sparrow. I think it's actually the first movie I haven't been injured on. Um, I mean, I, I think any any emotional scars or hardening for myself have probably just had to come from public scrutiny. <laughs> One must harden up. <laughs> If she's compromised, she will be eliminated.